Now relive the magical adventures of the movie Willow with these amazing characters that bring the story to life. There's the heroic swordsman, Matt Mardigan. I'll win this war for you. The evil sorceress, Bab Morda. The dreaded General Cain. I'll crush the rebels. And brave Willow himself. The epic battles, good versus evil. You can bring the magic of Willow home with collectible figures, vehicles, and accessories, each sold separately. Willow, the magic lies within. Is that his book of sorcery? Wow! Prologue. I right, ain't gonna let me read that. All right. He beat back Morda. A child was born. Elora Dannon. Elora Dannon. To save our world. Yes. Relentlessly pursued by the forces of darkness. I did ask was gonna name my kid Elora. I really was. I was gonna name her Elora Dannon. Willow was a man of pure heart. And unfailing courage. The other, Sasha, Madmartigan, thief, liar, and rogue. Madmartigan was the man I. Not died. a woman. What can I say? Oh, that's Sasha talking. I was young. Together we defeated my mother, Queen Vavmorda, and freed the kingdom of Tirasleen from its curse. Tiris Lean! Willow had a vision. That one day, an ancient evil would rise again and destroy the future Empress. And her end would herald a new dark age. There goes Mad Mordigan's sword! And so, Laura was hidden away. Her true identity concealed. Oh, okay. Even from herself. It was the only way I could... Oh, they started out with a lie. It, that that never that never goes well. No, who knows? Maybe in a few years you might actually beat me. <laughs> I would have beaten you five moves back if it wasn't that loose rock. Is that a Laura? Is she playing the Laura Dannon? It's about adapting to your terrain. Because the Laura Dannon was a redhead. That new one. Yeah. Superior in every way, you highness. Oh, she's a Laura Dannon. One day, I'm gonna prove it. You know, going beyond the barrier, having these wild adventures like we've always talked about. Okay, what's going on here? <laughs> you see that look she's giving her, right? Is that, is that too much? No. Uh, uh... You're trembling. Why? Yeah. I don't know. You just... You have this effect. <coughs> it's just like... Nothing I've ever experienced before. Me too. You've got a bit of a reputation. <laughs> I mean, if you've heard some of the things they say about you, things I know aren't true. What's his reputation? He a playboy? He a player? Some of them might be true, but that was before. That was before. I'm not that guy. This thing is a pimp and a half, yo! You know you're coming tonight, right? No. Yeah. Really? Yeah. You know how I feel about gowns and wearing Yeah, them. well, you're going to have to suck it up because I'm not going to be able to suck oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She pushing it up. She pushing it up. Yeah, <laughs> you know how I feel about gowns and weddings. <laughs> She is stunned. <laughs> oh, that's definitely Mad Mardigan's son. <laughs> he is definitely Mad Mardigan's son. That's not everything. That's that kitchen maid, right? That makes those buttered muffins everybody's always talking about. Hey, 
I happen to be a great admirer for muffins. Yeah, no, I'm just concerned about what she's going to put in those muffins when you inevitably break her heart. I'm not going to break her heart. Please, Eric, you're going to lose interest, and then you're going to move on to the next. It's like... Did they name him after Eric? From Eric's army? Is that why his name is Eric? <laughs> Oh, mother, we got your Sasha! Please race back. We're just gonna, we're just gonna wash up really quick. Why do you look like you've been rolling around in grass? Training. Tourneys and such. What's that on your neck? It's a hickey. Oh, I got bit by a fire moth, I think, which was strange. You sure it wasn't a dove? He's definitely Mad Mardigan's son. And where the fuck is Mad Mardigan? Alright, alright. So the red-headed chick is not Sasha's daughter. The boy is Mad Mardigan's son. He has to be. I'm still waiting to hear about what happened to Matt Mardigan. My lady? Don't. Valentine, don't. For Kit and only Kit do I endure this agony. Have you told her yet? Jake? I, I am going to. This is what you've always wanted. What you've worked for harder than anyone I've ever known. If she's really your friend, she'll be happy for you. She's going to feel like I'm abandoning her. When oh, she's where are you going? Lost. Who are these niggas? Graydon Haster. The Prince of Galadorn. Oh they shit! They He's the Prince of Galadorn! Them fell out of a tree. So I have to marry that one. And have you spoken to me? Yes. I curtsied. Except I've had similar reports from the North. Settlements torched and abandoned. What if it's something else? Nonsense. Nothing gets through the barrier, ever. Mm -hmm. Some got through the barrier, yeah, your majesty. <laughs> That's gonna be the next shit. Cook, I clean, I heal the sick, I actually made the This work. nigga's just like his pops, yo! And he just getting more bad bitches than my Mulligan! <laughs> my dad. He was great. He was a knight of Galadorn. Well, Mad Master came. Yeah. We all grew Mad Mulligan, yes! That's his father! From Queen Bavmore during the Battle of Knock Mar and You're supposed to be watching the ovens. Oh, she's a peasant girl. I think that countess is pretty. The one with the lifts in the face. So Mad Mardigan is dead. That fucking sucks. But that's Mad Mardigan, that's Mad Mardigan's son, who happens to look like Val Kilmer. So that's cool. But this nigga getting bad bitches, yo. <laughs> this nigga's like his pops. I love this shit. I gotta text fucking the bad man and let him know about this shit. Tomorrow, Prince Graydon marries my daughter, Kit. At last, unifying Terrasleen and Galadun, ensuring us... Neither one, one of them want to do that shit. ...and defend our realm till that day when the true yes. Empress, Elora Danis, uh -huh. stands. Till that day! Till that day! Till that day! I want you and that young man to tie that knot. I'm going to say a prayer for you. And I want you to hold on to God's unchanging hand to help Joshua get out the lion's den. To help Gilligan get off the iron. Yes, Lord. To the bride and groom. I have to go south with King Halston after the wedding. My wedding? <clears throat> Tomorrow? Well, I wanted to tell you before, but I just didn't know how to... Kit. Kit, stop. Hey, so we're getting married. That's weird, right? Oh, shit. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> no, you're not. Why? You don't even know me. Damn, she's just going to make a spectacle out of the whole thing, huh? She was a princess, Kashmir, thousands of years ago. And she was, like, by all accounts, like, the most gorgeous woman. Okay, she's starting to get on my fucking nerves already. <laughs> All of the princes to compete for her hand. Secretly entered the tournament to fight for herself. For a chance to, to choose her own future. I get it. She's the cliche she's rebel. Quick word, please. I tried that already. Why don't you make yourself useful? Say there was a tournament for my hand. We were competing. Oh, shit. She's really not going to do this to her brother, is she? My pretty twin brother. I'm a little worried about that. <laughs> oh, okay. So they're twins. So that's not Alora Dannon. Okay. All right. I'm up to speed. Got it. Where is Alora? I don't want to miss. No one chooses their life, Kit. Or their mom. That's right. 
Ooh. And if you think I'm tough, you should have met mine. Oh, yeah, that, for fine. real. Fine. I just spoke to Graydon. He was actually not such a terrible guy. You just get to know him. He's going to talk to the king, smooth everything over, explain... I think you all should stick to chasing girls rather than sticking your nose in matters that you're incapable of understanding and are not your concern. Woo! Okay, what did Matt Monaghan do to you? Everybody loves you because you're so charming and fun. As long as they don't expect anything from you. Because the moment that they do, you'll just leave. Just My dad. Like dad did. All right, there you go. <laughs> I'm not him. Oh yeah, you are, nigga. <laughs> you bagging bitches and everything. Where the hell did Matt Monaghan go? So he's not dead. He 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 ran off somewhere. I can't say goodbye. Okay, I know you're upset. I'm not. I'm not. I'm thinking clearly for the first time. In my what life. the fuck? If you were, you would understand that running away. This isn't about me. You don't hurt like that. <laughs> I mean, it is, but. I'm looking for something. Here it is. There you go. There you have it. And now you just pissed off a whole bunch of people. I'm not one of them. I don't give a fuck. But now I'm going to have to suck fucking... I bet you I get a bunch of fucking dumbass videos in my fucking YouTube suggestions about Woke Willow. God damn it. Gales. Who the Gales? That's a big ass bird. That is not a bird. That's somebody. That's a bird that transfers into someone. Okay. Are these the Gales? Is that fog? No, nope, that's a spell. You're about to be cussed. Pigs! You're all pigs! What's going on? <laughs> You're about to be cussed. Pigs! Oh shit! <laughs> gang, gang! Top! Oh, yeah. Get the sword! There we go! Let's go! Let's go! Oh shit! The sword! This shit looks clean as fuck! Alright, what kind of orc mischief is this? Holy shit, it's Pitbull number two, Gary Wolf! This thing is strong with the force! Boom! Who this motherfucker? Oh shit! They let him go! Why are they letting him go? We're under siege. Bone reefers. Something else. Something worse. Fellas, fetch my cleaver. Oh, he's a badass! Oh, he wants to see this thing do work! Come on! <laughs> my man, he got the whip! He got a better bomb! Shit! Every black person who just saw those whips just turned this fucking show off. <laughs> yeah, badass Sasha! Come on, Sasha! I love you, Sasha! I worship you, Sasha! Let's go, Sasha! Oh, shit. What is she gonna try to do next? Look at this nigga here! You just watch it, you pussy! Come on, Sasha, you can take this nigga. Oh no! No! Who is this motherfucker? What the hell is he doing to him? Sound like they're calling him back. They're gonna have to hold that L. It was just behind me. 
fighting that witch. Oh shit, they took him. Caught up with him on the edge of town, trying to steal a horse. False, painfully false. I was actually checking on the <laughs> conditions of the stables as I was concerned for the welfare of the. <laughs> I have to feel enough. This thing is stupid. Mother, I, I said I think I should go west to search for air. I heard you. And I agree. Oh. Okay. Well, Queen, if that is your decision, I volunteer to go with her. You're the commander of the Packalcade. And you hurt. Don't relinquish that responsibility to go questing. I'll go. I've known Eric since the day he was born. And he's as close to a son as I'll ever have. At least that I'm aware of. <laughs> You're just the leader this expedition needs. In that case, so is Graydon. Why not? You know it. <laughs> Be their guide. And I'll pardon all your crimes. Really? Even the one in the haberdashery with... Yeah, you know, I just like the feel of velvet on my... Even that. As good as setting him free. He'll see it done. Who's this thing a furry? He likes to feel a velvet. It's a square debt with an old friend. Mad Mardigan? You owe him a favor? Where would we even look? You can't track something that flies. Which is why you're going to need a sorcerer. Sorcerer? Terrific. Okay, all the sorcerers are gone. There's one. A Nelwyn. Yes! In the village on the river. A peck! <laughs> and I have a feeling he's expecting you. I'm counting on you as I would any night. Don't let, don't let your feelings get all up in you either, all right? You got a job to do. Do it. <laughs> he gonna die. Because whatever they did to him fucked his ass up. Or he's turning into something. How much further to the barrier? Another day, maybe less. The rangers garrisoned at the Mother's Gate are led by Commander Rima, an old friend. We can resupply before we head beyond the realm. Never seen the Mother's Gate. I Never been beyond it. Hey, don't worry. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff I've done that you haven't. That old man going to die enough. first. You know, that's what I thought. <laughs> Go home. You don't understand. We're in love. I don't know how to break it to you, but Eric has been in love with quite... Not like this. <laughs> Not like us. You think I'm a fool? Fine. Mm. I don't care. What we have comes around once, maybe, if you're lucky. And there is nothing we wouldn't do for each other. God I damn, your nose is face. wide open. She yeah, diving in head first. I mean, she like verbally. Against someone who wants to hurt you. No. Have you? Mm? I can do other stuff. <laughs> you need to <laughs> <laughs> Something's gotta cook, right? Are you very good? I'm phenomenal. She's <laughs> just fucking sucking on a chew stick like he a fucking Rastafarian. <laughs> Seriously? This thing is playing a flute. A flute? <laughs> yeah, was that not a good idea? My nan believed that music was a bomb for the soul, so... This is not some jaunt. Your chance to see the world, it's dangerous. And those things that took Eric, they're not just gonna give him back. Bitch, you never even been in combat! Shut the fuck up! Possum stew? Possum stew? I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all motherfuckers in the South have had that, right? Wow. <laughs> Phenomenal. Sleeping on the hard ground will cure anyone of their romantic fantasies. <laughs> yeah, but she ain't going nowhere. Unless she found the game, she won't get across that gorge. <sighs> Fuck around and she be a Laura Dannon. But a Laura Dannon will be older than Eric, so. Look at this. Don't tell. Oh, okay. Stand Indiana at the Jones shit is this? We peer into the void. We bear witness to his glory, the eternal one, the healer of worlds. Bray Wyatt? Uh, maybe you shouldn't have read that out loud. Oh, shit. All right, 
back, go back, go back, go back, go back. As he stirs from Unbelievable. his slumber. Stop reading that shit out loud! What the hell happened? Oh, okay. But your horse is over there. What did I say? You're not the boss of me, princess. Not out here. I like her. I think we should keep her. Nobody asked her. <laughs> I like her. I think we should keep her. Shut up, Orman. Eric doesn't have time. I don't care if you like each other. We're all in this together now. And out here, in the world beyond. If you're not vigilant at each moment, I swear you will not survive. Ooh! What the fuck did I say? I said he was going first. Why are you riding so slow? We're being chased. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. oh shit. Oh, She got shurikens and shit! Albert, you're supposed to be dead! Well, that's not me, mate. He said that's not me! <laughs> yeah, that ain't me, I'm from Buffalo! Zugala! <laughs> Corbin, what are you doing? Zugala! Zugala? Zugala! Zugala! Are afraid of water? I've never seen horses do that. What does Sugala mean? It's an ancient Angorian word. It means stop. Boy, <laughs> 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 is fucking awesome! Favorite character so far. Borman and the chick from fucking uh, uh, Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I love them both. Uh, I love them both. You're Willow? Yep, that's me. Willow, but I'm out of the sorcery business now. I've retired. So, <laughs> yeah. my name is Kate Tampa. Hey, Willow. <laughs> my mother is Sorsha. She sent me here to come find you. It's okay. She is who she claims to be. How do you know? I read her mind. There he is! Dude. Willow, oh, good! I didn't read your mind. It's just, you remind me of your mother. Beyond the edge of our world, into the unknown. It's the only way to, to. What are you? Future Empress, High Priestess, what? And sorceress of the Nine Realms, and the world's last, best hope against the evil coming to destroy us all. I mean, the only reason why I didn't think it was her because I was like, wait a minute, she should be older than Eric and, and his sister. If you have not seen Willow, then don't watch this show, okay? You have got to see, you have, you have to see Willow in order to understand this show. Period. Just like you would have to watch Lord of the Rings to understand the Rings of Power. So, that chick is a Laura Dannon. And I was, I, I, like I said, I, I'm like, she uh, fuck around and be a Laura Dannon. But I'm like, nah, because she's, she looks like she's younger. But she is a mystical princess or whatever. I guess she ages slowly. And it, it makes sense. Or well, Laura Dannon and the son of Matt Mardigan coming together to have a powerful child or family or whatever. I don't know. But that was cool. Um, his sister, she, she's, she's, she ain't into dudes. 
And I, I, I made the joke about the whole uh, woke willow and shit like that because, uh, unfortunately, you see, it's it's a fucking shame that that's the first place my mind goes to when I saw something like that instead of just saying, okay, whatever, or just, you know, not even giving a fuck about it at all because we're in this time period where, oh, my God, this 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 show based off this movie that I grew up in that 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 showed nothing of of the the LGBTQ community now has a a a, a, a character of the community and and it's like you know they're gonna say oh here here you go again with the wokeness and people make videos and them shits get caught in my fucking YouTube suggestions I don't even know why that happens but it does it's I guess it's because. You know, I do these reactions, and and, and there's so many com so much commentaries on, on these shows that when I watch other people's reactions, I, I don't know. I, I, I can't even figure it out. But all I know is they're probably going to have some people who are probably going to fucking make a bunch of videos about that shit because people are fucking stupid, uh, and they can't just watch something and enjoy it. Um, I watched this, and I enjoyed it. And we get two episodes um, to kick off the show, so I'm going to get started and watching the next one, all right? See you guys later. Oh, like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at A-Track Brown, the number 8 T-R-A-C Brown. And do not forget to hit that notification button and join the Hustle Fandom group, all right? See you guys later on episode two. Peace.